Hello, YouTube. How are you? Today, I'm going to be talking about peace, security, and prosperity. Could you use peace, security, and prosperity? Well, I believe anybody could use peace, security, and prosperity. Tonight I'm going to be considering three things, or three domains if you'd like. Three domains to consider, and there are several names for each one. Number one is us as individuals, men, women, human beings. Number two, humanity, society, civilization and that includes nations, governments, politics, politi political systems, any system, systems. Domain number three, the planet, the earth, floating in space, and on earth there's nature, oceans, air, atmosphere, plants, animals, animals like monkeys, animal, animals like us, humans. All the above can be seen as God's creation. All of it is important. Let's talk about peace. Are we talking about world peace, peace and quiet, or peace of mind? Well, let's talk about all of them. Let's consider how we see it as an individual. As an individual, we must understand that they are like us. They, our neighbors, our friends, our enemies, are like us. They all have beliefs based on concepts and experience, based on indoctrination. Indoctrination is everything a person believes in, or the, every, everything a person w is made to believe in, that can't be proved. They all have emotions, like love and hate. Ask yourself why. Why do they love you? Why do they hate you? And be aware of the effects of your actions. Do your actions make them love you or hate you? Let's talk about society. What's important for society, in my opinion, is moral values. There are many religions, and there are atheists. And what about people who believe in science? We need to join everybody. We need to have everyone adopt and consider moral values. What are moral values for? What is the purpose of moral values? Where do they come from? What are they? Are we losing them? Why are we losing them? Do they need to be rewritten? Do they need to be redefined? Do they need to be reinforced? 
Moral values have been developed over thousands of years by wise people observing human beha behavior and thinking about solutions. All that thinking resulted in customs, traditions, and the Bible. The planet, planet Earth, without it we don't exist. For four billion years there was a process. Photosynthesis, plants have been converting water and CO2 into carbohydrates and oxygen. By burning fossil fuel we are reversing this process, making the earth, the planet, every day a little more toxic, toxic for us humans. There is an urgent need for change. Talking about security, how do we want our security to be achieved? By intimidation? By having a strong army with advanced technology to protect us? Or by making friends? Which is easier? Which is more durable? Which makes more sense? Prosperity. We have been enjoying prosperity for years. Why? A few expressions. Slavery. The class system. The British Empire. Obeying without questioning. Money is the source of all evil. But people do things just for money. And that is taking us b back to moral values. Definition of prosper prosperity needs a serious rethinking. Prosperity for a few by the abuse of others? Is it really prosperity? Is it durable?